Yeah, so in the fall, we played a play day at York. We played Eastern and Catholic and York to finish. We had a pretty good offensive showing as well as uh, defensive showing. Pitching was um, about average, and that's what we expected. We had an injury at the end of that fall ball day, but we figured that our pitchers would be the ones that in the fall started off slower um, and then we're able to build strength leading into our games this uh, upcoming weekend, our first games at Wesley. But the pitchers have really, really made some progress, both miles per hour, spins, location, confidence, mobility, flexibility, all of the things um, with assistant coach Larry, who has been working with our pitchers. They were eight, they've really been able to make some strides. Um, and we can see it physically in them, as well as kind of their approach in a bullpen and approach in an inner squad um, on the pitching side. On the offensive side, um, we have added uh, some slappers to our lineup. Our upperclassmen and, and our middle classes as well have really come back with more power um, and hitting the ball with more authority on the inner half as well as the outer. With team building, we've done a really great job of focusing on supporting one another. We did a team rock climbing trip, and that was a lot of fun. Um, and I, what I've been trying to tell them is don't be afraid to fail. We're in a failure sport. You're probably going to fail at some point. How do we react to that? How do we move forward as a team? I think that we're going to be a little bit more of a rowdy team. We're going to hear us cheering. It's going to be a loud game, and I think that will translate onto the field. I think our bats are going to be really loud this year. I think our pitching is going to do a great job, and I think that we're going to show a little bit more speed with balance of that power, which makes it a little, a little bit more exciting, a little more fun for the viewer.